Hello everyone. Today I have a couple of things to share with you. I've got a couple of um, Happy Mail packages that turned up today that um, is really lovely. I feel like I'm being extra specially spoilt lately and um, I mean I'm not complaining at all. I think it's absolutely beautiful. Um, just <laughs> yeah <laughs> I'm not used to it. I'm not used to it. Okay. Um, okay, so we'll open this one first. Now this one is from Hazel. And Hazel is a friend on YouTube and a lovely friend. And I didn't know I was um, I didn't know she was sending me anything. She has sent me a little something here, which is really, really sweet. Sure I'm in frame there. It says, Hi Jeanette, hope you don't already have this stamp. Let's have a look. Oh wow, no! I don't have an awful lot of stamps. Um, that's why I don't use a lot of stamps. <laughs> Isn't that lovely? Look at, oops, sorry. I've got the um, viewfinder on the side. I should put it down that way a bit so I can at least make sure there we go isn't that wonderful well that'll be lovely and tags and cards and things like that thank you so much Hazel that's wonderful thank you and that's it's called Parade by Kaisercraft and some lovely lace very pretty thank you Hazel Hope you can use the bags. I got them at Kmart. You have probably already seen them. Good price. They are. They're wonderful. Yes, I saw. Um, I think Var put up a um, video a little while ago, and she was talking about the um, paper bags from Kmart in Australia and I know to you American ladies you probably can get paper bags anywhere but we have a real hard time finding any kind of pretty bags um, and these ones are those you know the one with the bottom here um, and they're actually they're very good to decorate and, th and thank you so much for that Hazel I need some bags I do need some more bags and I've got to get busy with the bags. So that was really sweet Hazel, thank you so much for thinking about me, that was really lovely. Really, really, really lovely, thank you. And the other package is, uh, this one is, this one is from Greece. This one is from Zephy and I just want to show you all those fabulous stamps across there, look at that. I think I'll be keeping those. Uh, one. And Zephy did say she was sending me some napkins over. So let's have a, a little look here. Wow. Just got to try and get it out. Whoa. And Zephy has a challenge on at the moment. Um, it's to a dress form challenge. And I have entered her challenge. And I will put a link to her challenge below. I think it's still going. Um, and she's a lovely lady. And she's actually, I think it's summer there and spending the summer on an island at the moment and how exotic does that sound a Greek island it sounds wonderful so let's start with these gorgeous napkins look at that isn't that just divine look at that it's beautiful I love that and there's four of them that is wonderful oh I love that I'm going to find something for that because that's really lovely oh wow Oh, I do like that one. Sorry if I wasn't high enough, ladies. Let me just show you that other one in case I wasn't high enough. Isn't that beautiful? I love the soft pink in that. 
and this gorgeous napkin here. That's really lovely, isn't it? Very, very nice, and it's just like a an off-white colour. And oh well. Wow. Oh, isn't that pretty? That would be so nice on a card because it already has the sentiment on it. Oh, that's so pretty. Thank you. And there's four to that. There's four to all of them, of course. There usually is. Yes. That's why napkins are so great because you get four in one. That's wonderful. Oh, there's another one. Thank you. Thank you so much. Isn't it pretty? Like a bluebird. And then this one. This one's really sweet. Isn't it? It'd be great for Valentine's too because it's got the red hearts. But even just um, my daughter would love this sort of thing, the bright colours. Oh, look how cute. <laughs> Owls. It's lovely to get napkins from around the world because everybody seems to have different napkins. I mean, we say here, oh, we don't get these kind and we don't get that, but obviously we get napkins, so ours would just be different kinds of napkins. They just don't seem to be as nice as everybody else's napkins. Believe in yourself. Is there any better way to deal with life than love and humour? Charles Dickens. Turn your face to the sun and the shadows fall behind you. Live. That's lovely, isn't it? I do like that one. Thank you. And another bluebird. Thank you so much, Sophie. And... That's a, that's a cardboard cutout, and it, she has um, sprayed that. It's all beautiful and glimmery, look. Isn't that lovely? I've been gluing today. I've been crafting, but I ran out of glue. Oh, oh, oh that one's got a little stud in the middle of it. Look at that. See that little gold stud? Thank you so much, and it's already got a hole drilled in it, which is excellent. Excellent. And there's a little butterfly. And we have these beautiful pieces of trim. And I think I actually saw um, Zephy show these off on her channel, how she'd got these... Um, I forget where she said she got them a little second hand place or something that particular day. That's a lovely colour. It's beautiful. And they looked they look wonderful. Isn't that sweet? Look. That's really lovely. Thank you so much. And then there's this one. Oh, I love that. That is so, that's so delicate. I'm just trying. It's, there we go. Can you see that? Isn't that delicate? It's really beautiful. I love these old laces like that. You can see, you can see it's quite old. That's beautiful. I love it. And it, you know, that's the usual way I end up getting mine as well if I get them from eBay. Um, and I think they, I, I like the wrinkly look of them, I really do. Oh, wow. Well. Oh, I like that. Isn't that lovely? I'm just trying to get it all in. Is that your stenciling? That's really nice. Thank you so much for that. I will definitely be using that. That's really nice. Hmm. Isn't that pretty? Um, you have to tell me exactly what you've done there. I can see you've used stencils on here, but I'm not quite sure what you've put over that. But it's really lovely. I'm not quite sure what technique you've used 
or bottom, whether it's paint or something else. It's really lovely though. Yeah. Love the crinkle. And then we have a die cut, all different sizes there. Oh, is this something like you make a flower with it? I've it probably is, but because I've never really used them or had them, I'm not quite sure, but it looks like one of those things that you spiral up into a, a flower, so I'll have a little look at that afterwards. Gauze stamp. Oh. oh, I need to open one. I need to open one because because this is what you can use on your projects if you can't find cheesecloth or anything like that you can use the gauze the medical gauze how wonderful thank you so much for that Sophie it's always lovely to try new things isn't it now I'm trying to, I sent my, um, I sent my challenge project off to you and I'm, I'm wondering, I thought, I think I may have included some cheesecloth in there but I just can't remember. So if I didn't, I will make sure that um, next time I send you some cheesecloth. Because I'm not sure if you can get the same as what we have here over there. That's wonderful. Thank you so much for it. Look at all, how many she said. That's so many. Thank you for that. I appreciate that a lot. And some more of these. Little. Oh, they're different. Okay. So we have those ones like that. Thank you. The birds are really no noisy today outside. Oh, I love the feel of that. Oops. Oh my goodness. Okay. We have some dictionary paper that's in English. English dictionary paper, thank you so much. And this one, yes, that's English as well, but look what she's hidden in the middle here. Yes. I don't want to rip anything. Ah, oh, there we go, I've got it because I think she's used repositional glue. Oh, wow, look at these. Oh, I love those little dangly, see these little, what are they? They're like a, they remind me of the fishing, the fishing things. Aren't they great? I love the color. I really do love the color. What a clever way to put them. And some filigrees. Love the silver. I have, yes, I, well, actually not that particular one. Something very similar though, I think. This is the one, the silver is what I find very difficult to get out of here. And that, that's like a gum metal colour, that one there. They're wonderful. Thank you, Zephy. I won't put that back on top. Thank you so much for that. Some more stenciling I can use. I'm going to have to start like a, what do they call them, art journals and learn some new things like this because it's not something I would, you know, I will practice on a project that I'm making but I do it in a journal just to practice and just to do it and I would use these on Christmas tags and things like that as well. Thank you so very much. Oh wow, I like that. That's a napkin. Look at that, it's got like a embossed pattern on it, isn't that gorgeous? 
it's really lovely thank you and I think I just spotted a tag <gasps> Tag. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, I love the turquoise colors. I really do. And I love your dress form. Isn't that beautiful? She's embossed that dress form on there. She's very artistic. Very artistic. And then she's doodled around the edges here. There's a flower and crocheted medallion and a feather pearls, butterfly, and it's all shimmery and shiny. It's gorgeous. It's a lovely stamp, isn't it? I have a dress from, you know, like an old-fashioned dressmaker's dummy, but it's in storage, and I've been collecting pieces from Zendelay every so often, so that when she comes out of storage, I love that, um, I can make her her a corset and I have a bodice and I have a neck part <laughs> so one day I'll get to do it I'll just read this so sweet of you Zephy. That is so so sweet of you. She wanted to pop some shells in here as well but she thought they might get um cause problems in customs and they could well do because you know they um they're very particular about what comes through now. Um, I think it's so sweet you wanted to send me some napkins. You know I when you said you wanted to send some I thought oh how lovely isn't that gorgeous? That is just so beautiful. I wonder if you could... Um, oh, look, you could open that and put that on the top of a box or on the cover of a journal or something. That is just gorgeous. The gold and the white. Very beautiful. Thank you so much. And this one's like lace. And you could do the same with that, couldn't you? Because they're like a mirror image. Look at that. Or even on a canvas or something. It's really pretty. Thank you for that. Oh, wow. Well. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous colour? Oh, such a gorgeous colour. I don't use this colour a lot, but I absolutely love this colour. It would have to be my second, probably, favourite colour. Mm, that's beautiful. I absolutely love that colour. And then there's two more. Of, oh no, one more. It's just folded a little bit crooked of this gorgeous print one which is really lovely with the butterfly and the, the postal symbols on it that's so lovely of you that's so lovely of you Zephy I really do appreciate that absolutely gorgeous tag please pop over and um, see Zephy's challenge all you have to do is make a tag or a card or something similar with a dimensional dress form on it and even like how she's got here she's just stamped her dress form and she has a pearl there which makes it a little bit dimensional that's all she's looking for just something to add a little bit of dimension to that dress form very simple and she has the most gorgeous prizes very um, interesting prizes you know things that you um, probably wouldn't be able to get hold of so please um, I'll put a link to her, give, her giveaway challenge below. It's really lovely. Thank you, Zephy. Thank you so very much. And thank you, Hazel, for your lovely gift also. I really do appreciate it, ladies. I really do. Thank you for everyone for watching again. Bye.